welcome to the stage, Triple Diamond Director, Teresa Gregory! to have you to be a part of our Jeunesse family. You know, don't we have something special here? I mean, it is so special in our Jeunesse family, our company, our products, our owners. It's like the perfect storm has come together and it is really touching and affecting lives around the globe. And we welcome every one of you to be a part of our family. So I'm gonna to talk to you today a little bit about achieving your dreams. I have been in the industry over, this is my 43rd year. I can't believe it. And I'm just as passionate now and more fired up and more encouraged and more really wanting each and every one of you to achieve your dreams, desires, and visions. How many of you have dreams that are within you? Let me see your hands. Yes, you do. Every one of you do. We were created in our spiritual DNA. That word desire that is in you is really of the Father. You were put on this earth to do great things. Do you believe that? Yes. yes. You were put in this world to light a world. And we all have a world to light, don't we? Think of how many lives we can touch and change. So achieving your dreams, sometimes it seems so distant, doesn't it? Sometimes it seems so out there, but sometimes there's that little gentle nudging in our life that says it's still alive. It's still alive within you. It's still alive, what I've called for you. It is still alive, the purpose, the destiny, the plan for you. It is alive within you. Sometimes it seems like it's a smoldering fire, but a little smoldering fire underground can create a raging fire when it just ignites another dry spark. So how many of you have had dry seasons in your life? Let's be honest. Come on, we all have. And sometimes we look at that mountain. We look at those big mountains in life. We look out at the distance. And we say, I know my dream, my destiny, my purpose is out there. It may be at the top of that mountain and there may be valleys in between. There may be ridges and hard terrain. There may be cliffs that you have to climb, but your dream is at the top of that mountain. It is there for you. And so achieving your dream, sometimes it takes work. Sometimes when you see those dreams, we go down in the valley. How many of you know the valley in life? Sure you do, but the valley, the valleys in life. You know, everybody wants the mountaintop in life, don't we? We always want to be on the mountain. But really, the tops of a lot of the mountains, you get there and there's a lot of rock. There's a lot of shale. It may not be the prettiest place at the top of the mountain, but it can help you to see that next mountain. You know, we go, it says we go from glory to glory to glory. That little two sometimes is a long spread in life to get to that next step. So you look for your dreams, you attain your dreams by going through different areas in life. You all have goals in Jeunesse, don't you? You have places you wanna be, don't you? How many know they wanna be at the top in the Jeunesse family? Let me see your hands. Well, I want you to enjoy the journey getting there because the journey to executive, the journey to being a pearl, a jade, a sapphire, a ruby, every step, every level has an unbelievable place in your life. I can remember once in my life, I thought, I know this is what I'm called to do, and, but it seemed like I was stuck here and I couldn't get to the next step and get to the next step. And sometimes we wanna go from A to Z but we forget to enjoy the journey. So look at your dream, capture that dream, capture that promise that nothing can take that vision, that dream, that desire from you. Because Jeunesse can help dreams come true. It's helped us to take, especially some of the goals I've had to a whole new level that I never thought, dreamed, or imagined. You know, sometimes it just takes extra faith 
Faith is the evidence of things not hoped for, but the evidence of it's the substance of things not hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. We have to blindly sometimes believe. We have to blindly take that step. We have to blindly go when we don't know where we're going. We sign up. We say, what's the next step? Well, we'll tell you, just walk. Let's lock arms together. And sometimes you'll have people walking with you to help you take that step. So we lock arms together as a team, as a family, because we want you to obtain your dreams, goals, desires, and visions. You know, I can remember being in the industry 43 years that it seemed like we went through a phase where everybody said, how can I help you? How can I help you? How can I help you? And we wanted to hear about everybody's dreams, goals, desires, and visions. And that was the right thing to do. And in this world, that is still the right thing to do, to be the light and to help others in our homes, in our communities, in our churches, in our synagogues, in our places of worship, wherever, in our courthouses. Lord knows we need it. And the political system, Lord knows we need to be that light wherever we are. So achieve your dreams because you are lighting somebody's world. When I ask people, when they say, who am I going to talk to? I'll tell you what I do. I am a person of faith, and I believe that everybody in my path, I say, God, help me to touch somebody's life, that I can help them get to where they need to be, and they can help me. Together, we can obtain and go and help each other's dreams, desires, and visions. So obtaining those dreams, sometimes it takes the hard places, but it all starts with belief. Do you believe you have a dream? Do you believe? Do you believe Janice is for you? Let me see your hands. Let me hear you. Is Janice for you? Okay, if you know it's for you, some of you are going to walk out of here today and say, you know, I don't know what the heck I'm doing, but I'm feeling the love. I'm feeling the enthusiasm. I'm feeling I need to do this. And it's okay if you don't know everything. In fact, we love when people, that's contagious energy. People are contagious and they love it. That's that new baby distributor. And they want to run and there's nobody or nothing stopping them. So it starts with belief as you climb the steps of success with Jeunesse and in your Jeunesse family. It all starts sometimes blindly saying, I'm just going forward. There's a destiny, a purpose in me. So I'm going to dream big. How many of you, if you're going to dream, you want to dream big? Come on. You know, the command center of heaven is waiting to get them to you. So dream big, ask big. We have not because we ask not. So you need to ask. Don't you need? It's that simple. It is that simple. We have not because we ask not. So dream big. Put in your order in the command center and say, I know I can do great things. I know I can touch lives. I know I can help others. I know that I can do good things. The industry went through a shift where all of a sudden, I hope I'm not spraying the front row here, the industry went through a shift where we kind of got, and I believe in our country, we got a little greedy and we looked at people instead of, how can I help you to what can I get from you? And I'm telling you, it changed. It shut down. The blessings stopped flowing. The flow stopped when you have the right heart attitude the right mindset when you have a big dream that's bigger than you when you know that I can do this Janess is going to help me to get to my dreams I've had some of the same dreams for years and I, I look at those and I think oh my gosh I can't believe this is happening I can't believe this is happening but I can believe now okay, and so we start believing start walking it out step by step and so many people say, I don't have enough money. That's the first thing that, that hinders us. And I call that an ungodly belief. Don't believe those UGBs in your life. Because we have an awesome Father who wants to do great and mighty things in and through us. Yes. And it's a time. It's a time that we are going to be a light on the planet as you light your world. You know, sometimes we say, what am I going to do? What am I going to be? Am I in the will of God? Am I not? And you're saying, what am I doing here in Jeunesse? What am I doing here now? What am I doing in this place? Because you asked to have good things in your life. And I believe you're right where you need to be. Right here. Right in these seats. Right now. To do what you can do. You know, about eight years ago, I said that 
networking would be a safety net in the world today. Where do you go in your 40s, 50s, and 60s and start over? Where do you go when you come out of college and there is no place to be? Where do you go? What is it when you're a networker and all of a sudden you thought you were going to be at the top and you had to start over? What happens? Do we lose the belief? Do we lose the promise? I'll never forget, years ago, I wanted to quit. And we had done good things, great things, and seeing promises. And I have two of my best friends right now. I lost both of them in a year. And the one used to say, she's African-American. We met at a conference and a New Yorker on top of that. And she was my big sister. And she, I wanted to quit. And she said, child, God hasn't put that much within you to quit now. And I'm saying that to some of you. There's great things in you. The gift, the ability, the light, the love, the catalyst that you can be to touch lives and change lives. But sometimes, sometimes, you know, you have that dream. And then my other friend just passed December 23rd. My best friend and my dog in December. But you know, we all have that in life. We all have those issues. But I believe there's a big command center in heaven that has all our loved ones, and they're rooting for us. I believe our Father says, co-labor with me. There's my kid. Have you seen Jason? Have you seen Stephanie? Have you seen Cece? Have you seen Jenny? Have you seen what they're doing down there? Have you seen the light that Meredith is? Have you seen what Dennis is doing? As we co-labor together, we can light our world. So what is your world? What are you lighting? What are you lighting? We can all do something for good or evil. Everything we do is for good or evil. What side of the line are you on? So we know in life, as you capture those dreams, those visions, those desires, as they're within every ounce of your being, in your spiritual DNA code, the line minds are there. The danger signs are there. And I tell people, you know, and look, I was raised in Sunday school, and we've all had, I might tell you a little, uh, little stories, but, you know, when Eve took that apple, and she took that apple, and everything changed. Everything changed. And then God said, what did you do? And she said, but, 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 but the woman to Adam. But, but, but the woman. And then to Eve, what did you do? But, 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 but the serpent. And I believe that the landmines in life, what is a song that doesn't kill you makes you stronger, that they're used to strengthen us, to give us endurance. As the, can you still believe, can you still believe that you want to be that executive, that jade, that pearl, that sapphire, no matter what the line mines are in your life, no matter what somebody might say, you're going to do what? You're going to do one of those things? You're going to be this, you're going to be that. What about your school? What about your education? Can you still believe? What about when they come and hook the car? Can you still believe? What about when they say, don't leave home without it? Can you still believe? What about when you're walking the streets and you're not in a home? Can you still believe? Am I speaking to anybody here? Can you still believe? Do you still believe? Do you believe when there's some negative press? Do you believe when your friends turn their back? Do you still believe? and the promises that are laid out for you. We all have our destiny, our purpose. I want you to think about it right now, collectively in this room. What is within you to light your world and to do great things? What's in you? What's created in you? It's bigger than another ambassador. It's bigger than another distributor. I look at the people I'm working with, begat, likeness begats likeness. Our team wants to do great things on the earth. So we've been able to take our Jeunesse business to another level. Jeunesse has helped us from helping one orphan or two orphans to helping hundreds of orphans and providing schools, providing jobs, providing agriculture. What is your why? What is your why? Maybe it starts with a nicer car. Maybe it starts with a nicer school. Don't allow somebody to take your dreams to go to the top. I'm not saying Jeunesse is for everyone, but I'm saying it is a wonderful vehicle to light your world.
and to like the ones around you. I believe now more than ever that networking is a safety net in the world today, that we haven't seen anything yet. We haven't seen anything yet. We are still laying the foundation with Jeunesse Global. Do you believe that? Do you really believe that? Do you know what, guys? I'm telling you, we're still trying to talk to the networkers. We're still trying to make those contacts. What about the masses on the street? What about that housewife like I was that wanted to make $200 just to stay home with her kids? And now that has taken me from the jungles of Africa to president's offices to speaking in front of parliament and congressional wards. I never dreamed that would happen. I moms, you need, how many of your moms would really like to be home with your kids? Come on. The truth be known, many of us, our families are very important. So when those danger minds come, when, the, when you're going through the field of the minds, when you know a little bit about what they are and where they are, you can say, I'm still believing. I'm still believing that I have a promise. I'm still believing that I'm going to be that diamond with Jeunesse. But enjoy the journey along the way. So be a dream giver. You can help somebody else with their dream not just their goals goals are great guys they're so instrumental they go back to the oldest book that i'm aware of and an instruction manual that's just a back of two two inscribe them on the tablets for an appointed time that a herald will run with them boy inscribing them on the tablets back then was etching it in stone are your goals etched in stone to get you to where you need to be that nobody can take it. Be a dream giver. Be a promise keeper. Encourage others. You can do it. Look to the person to the left and to the right and say, you can do it. You can do it. We are doing it. We can be the biggest network marketing company in the world. Do you believe it? Yes, we can be. We're going for it. We're going for it. It doesn't matter. That mountain may be big, but we're climbing. You got your climbing shoes on, folks. Are you ready? Man, if this grandma can do it, you can do it. Catch me if you can. Be a dream giver. I want to be an encourager right up to the day I take my last breath because this world is amazing. It is amazing the gift that we've been given every breath that we take to touch and change lives. Make that dream big. Make it bigger than you. Jeunesse is an unbelievable vehicle to help you obtain your dreams, goals, and divisions. And what could be more exciting to do that with others that you care about and that you love and you want to lock arms with and run to the top? Be a dream giver. Be an encourager. If it's not for you that came, that's okay. It is for us. It is for the person that invited you. Pat them on the back. Be a customer. Say, I'm happy for you. I'm going to refer people to you. I'm going to encourage you. I see this is big. I'm going to be your best cheerleader. Right? Be a dream giver. Think big. Think big, do big, act big, and believe. You know, one of the things that I've noticed in life, you know, it, the battlefield is the mind. You know, the battlefield is so much the mind. I tell people, never make a decision when you're tired. I'm sure everybody's tired after being in Vegas. Never make a decision when you're tired, when you're sad, or when you're angry. Don't make emotional decisions because we're all a sum total of our choices. And I'm sure many of us have made decisions we wish that we hadn't made. Be in this for a long haul. Don't sell your inheritance for a cup of porridge, and some of you know what that means. Don't act to immediate needs. Think long term, think big, dream big, act big, be big, and huge things will begin to happen in your life. Make the why bigger than you. I'm gonna close like I always do. Everyone, please stand with me. You're awesome. Janessa's is awesome. This is your weekend. Some of you have some decisions to make. We want you to run with us. Again, it may not be for you. It is for the person that brought you, for a family that loves each other, that encourages each other, that sings happy birthdays together. 
Our kids grow up together. My best friend, who just went on to be with the Lord, our kids grew up together, our grandkids together, and I know she's in that command center saying, go, Teresa, keep touching lives. Light your world. Light your world. Keep lighting those worlds. Keep touching those lives. Go for the top. Don't settle. Don't just settle down here. Settle for the best that you were created to be. So I want you to look to the person to the left and to the right of you, just around you, and say, you are a diamond. Just tell them that. Come on, you are a diamond. You are a diamond. That's right, you are a diamond. Over here, you are a diamond. You are a diamond. You are a diamond. Okay. I want everybody, how many of you have a phone? I want all of you to turn on your lights. Turn on your lights on your phone. Turn on your lights. Wave that light. You know, a diamond has many facets. And you may not make it to a diamond in Jeunesse. We hope you do. We pray you do. We want you to because it can change your life. But you are a diamond in life. And your light can light the world. Touch your world. Touch your people. Touch those around you. And we can touch lives. So on the count of three, I want us all to say together, I am a diamond. Ready? I am a diamond. Again, I am a diamond. Thank you. God bless you. Yeah,